Hey, what's up, guys? Jimmy here. Uh, thank you for joining me. I'm glad that you're here. First off, I want to apologize. Um, I said I was going to make more videos this year, um, and so far I am doing that, uh, but not at the pace that I wanted, and maybe not at the pace that you would like me to. So for that, I apologize. Uh, being an adult and the responsibilities that come with it uh, has kind of hindered that uh, that goal. But I mean, I'm here and. That's all that counts, right? Besides me apologizing for the lack of uploads, um, I wanted to talk about Power Rangers. So as you can tell, I'm a fan of Power Rangers. And I'm not talking about the Power Rangers that we grew up with, the ones from the 90s and even the, the show that's airing currently on Nickelodeon. Uh, the version of the Power Rangers I want to talk about is the uh, fan film, the deboot as it's being deemed by the director and the producer of the film. Um, and I want to talk about it because it is something that I've been asked about quite a bit actually. Um, surprisingly um, by people I know in real life and some people that I chat with online. They've, they've asked my thoughts about it knowing that I'm a Power Ranger fan and I shared those thoughts with them and I want to share them with you. Uh, first and foremost, I just want to say um, my opinion is my opinion, your opinion is your opinion. Whether or not you like the film, uh, that that's your opinion. It's not a wrong opinion, it's just your opinion. So um, we're, we'll discuss this in the comments if you'd like. Uh, just be respectful because I respect your opinion. Please do the same thing for mine. Um, so uh, overall, as, as a film, um, I want to <laughs> talk about it in two sections. It's a 20 minute short, um, and I want to talk about it kind of in two parts. Uh, the first part, I want to talk about it as an action film. Um, it has action, it has explosions, it has guns, it has plenty of violence, plenty of blood, um, some sex, drugs, and pretty much anything you'd expect from uh, a good action flick. And as an action flick, it definitely delivers it, you know, if you just want to uh, turn off your brain for a while. Uh, this is a good film or good short to do it. Um, it's not safe for kids. It's not the Power Rangers any of us grew up with. It is a much, much darker uh, take on it. Um, whether or not you like that, that's uh, again up to you. Um, I personally don't mind dark films, dark comedies. You know, I don't mind it at all. Um, but now this moves forward to judging it as a Power Rangers property. Um, it is a fan film, um, just according to the director, it was made for himself, it was made because he wants it, he wanted to make it, he's not accepting money for it, he didn't do a Kickstarter, none of that. So, um, But as a fan film, as a Power Ranger film, I don't think it's any good. Um, and before you kind of get your pitchforks out, uh, please allow me to explain why I personally didn't like it. Um, Power Rangers was, or is, about friendship, it's about teamwork, it's as cheesy as it is, that's what it's about, and this film really had none of that. I mean, yes, there was parts where they were, uh, you know, a team, um, and I'm, I'm trying not to do any spoilers because um, there are probably a few of you that haven't watched it, um, but uh, yeah, it was missing a lot of elements that I believe um, make Power Rangers special. Um, so that's why it's not a good Power Rangers movie, in my in my opinion. Uh, Power Rangers are campy. I, I mean, it's it's really hard to make a uh, property like Power Rangers dark and gritty because Super Sentai, uh, where we take the stock footage from, that's super campy and cheesy. Both of, it's also a kids show in Japan. So to take something like that and make it dark and gritty, it's kind of weird. Um, I know that Hollywood has this obsession of making or trying to make a bunch of properties uh, dark and it works sometimes, it doesn't work others. It works for films like the Batman trilogy, um, you know, Christopher Nolan's, that was dark and gritty and it worked because that movie was grounded in reality and the dark and grittiness comes from that and that was just the icing on the cake. If you give me a, you know, a movie that's nothing but dark and gritty and it loses what it originally was, then you're just handing me a bowl of icing. And while that might seem awesome at first, um, if you've ever eaten a bowl of icing, you'll know how terrible it is after a few spoonfuls. So, um, weird analogy aside, um, this movie, or any 
for any property this colorful at one point to transition to something dark and gritty it needs to be uh, grounded in some sort of reality it needs you know the darkness and the grittiness comes after everything else should come first um, and that definitely doesn't work for this specific film uh, to make Power Rangers darker and grittier it would need to be a cross of <clears throat> excuse me it needs to be a cross of Pacific Rim and Guardians of the Galaxy in order for this specific franchise to work as a dark property um, you know fans have been wanting dark Power Rangers for a really long time this fan film seemed to deliver on a much darker and grittier um, method and it seems to kind of uh, fill the void for some people who've been wanting it, others who have, um, you know, they, now they want more. And um, with the way this film was and the way Saban reacted, um, will there be a part two? Maybe, um, but I, I don't know and I wouldn't hold my breath for it. I would just wait for the official Lionsgate film that should be released, I believe, next year. Um, so that's my thoughts on that specific fan film. So what do you guys think about the film? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Um, what made you love it? What made, made you hate it? Um, please leave a response in the comment section below. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It lets me know that you liked it. Um, and maybe add it to your favorites. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. Um, at this rate, I'm going for one video a month. At this rate, but hopefully um, it picks up. Alright guys, take care. I will see you.